tell you too much breaking tight, so I'm back before we get to it. Make sure you like, down subscribe as you always. Watch full video. So now previously I spoke on Corey having a request for Carmen, and that was to see his son for his Bro, birthday. Can we all cross our fingers and can we all pray to God and just hope that I can see my kids on his my, my son on his birthday, bro? Because Ada's birthday was yesterday, and I'm finna go get, pick him up tomorrow. Me and um, Danny throwing a birthday party for the kids. Her daughter's birthday uh, finna come up also this weekend. So they coming up here this weekend. So Aiden go have a, a, a nice sad birthday party and everything. We're going to take them out tomorrow and, and Saturday. So now the kids are there and Corey made a stay. First off, my only thing about this is like, I, like I, I sort of supported it. I feel like when he make them type of videos, these are fake. These are just, let me post them, just to post them. Or let, let me post something to make y'all look at her bad because she's holding my, she's, you know, she's not letting me see my kids. Because at the end of the day, we can do nothing for you. Yes, people, people can be all her DMs, all her comment section. That, is, that does not mean that she's going to listen to anybody. The one people, the peoples, or the one person that can for sure make her do it, no questions asked, is a judge. Why? Why do people bring the, the internet into situations where you, <laughs> hey, if they're not listening, it's somebody that will make them listen. Why? Why not go to them? Statement stating that they are coming up here this weekend. So I'm not sure if he was talking about Aiden or Danny's kids because I thought Danny's kids actually live with them in the house. But anyways, like I stated, the kids are there now carmen did release a few statements herself regarding her children she first went on to instagram and she posted never let your storm get your kids wet carmen states never Thanks. so now i'm wondering if carmen is going to be up for letting corey have the boys for cj's birth yeah she yeah if you put that statement out because that's basically what from the outside looking in that y'all doing y'all conflict y'all beef y'all whatever is making you oh you you hurt my feelings you did this you did this you called me this you said this i don't feel comfortable enough with you to you know hey like, like some people then been in the conversation and said he might try to use the moments of him seeing the kids as a way to see the kids and take them away from her so therefore that might be a fear that might be a fear but at the end of the day you still is a mom we already know when it comes to court they gonna side with the mom before they side with the dad so therefore I mean, I, I can't say that for because I, hey, I'm not a judge. You know, telling high, it, it might go left. It, it's, it's anything is possible in this, in this crazy world. So therefore, it's nothing is a hundred percent certainty. But still, like we can do nothing for you. And then at the end, these kids are going to get older. They they going to be on social media because who's not on social media? You can tell them, oh, don't have it, don't have it, don't have it. The more you try to uh, straight on away from social media, the more that they're going to sneak and be on social media, and then they're going to go find out why you don't want them there. And then they're going to see all the beef, all the back and forth, all the the, the tweets and that. People got to like When you have kids involved, y'all got to think about that. One day, they're going to see this. She also goes on to say, I don't post my kids, not because I don't have them, but because I protect them from y'all evil people who don't mind saying negative ish about kids. And I know me when it comes to my kids, I'm going to get out of character. My kids are well taken care of. Have a good weekend. She also states, I'm so overprotective of my kids. I'm very sensitive how people view them, talk to them, all that. And I'll never been the type to keep a camera on them. They growing up, they'll decide if they want to record their lives. I show y'all them when I want to, not because I have to or need to. So now, of course, if they go over to Corey's, he's going to have the camera in their face. He's either going to have them on YouTube or on live or something like that. But anyways, you guys leave your opinions on this down in the comment section. below. But him doing that, like, look, mind you, that's her point of view of it. That, that does not mean that he has to be on that. I mean, y'all could agree on that if that's what y'all want to agree on. Like, hey, we're, we're both not going to post our kids. Nay, if y'all agree on that, then y'all agree on that. That's that's cool for me. I will say agree on that because, bruh, like she said, people are weird. Like, me personally, I don't see how somebody can can 
conjure up the, I guess the, I don't even know how to put it, like, like the, you know, to see a kid feel whatever that they feel, think whatever that they think, and really type it, and really post it. Something got to be mentally wrong with you, bro. It's a kid. It's a kid, but it's a lot of people who don't care. And then, like, like I said before, when it comes to, to them people, them, them uh, P files, they have social media too. So be cautious. Be cautious about posting anything. Like, yeah, it's, it's, your, it's, your, it's your profile. Do what you want to do. But just always be mindful. You don't know everybody that's following you. Oh, now Corey and Danny have three of the kids, her two plus Aiden, and they are going on a little trip for the kids' birthday. So you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below. I'm curious to see what's going to happen if Corey doesn't actually get to get CJ for his birthday. Now, they are both in Houston. I'm not sure if Corey and Carmen's kids are in Houston or back in Alabama, but Carmen and Corey are both living in Houston right now. Hey, babe, where did I ever get a kid? Huh? Babe, where the key to the Lambo at? This thing could be on live more than he be on uh, posting on YouTube. That's crazy. Huh? What? Babe? All right, babe. <laughs> she said her nickname, babe. I got her. Where the, where the key to the Lambo at? Nah, what you doing? You driving first. Come on, now. Stop playing. Okay. You get comfortable and stuff. Excuse you. Stop. All of oh, the fun the kids, bro. I'll, I'll come and lock the door here real quick. You, you can put it in the uh, garage. Put it in the garage, nah? Nah, I can't put it in the garage. That that that, that car in the way. You know, I think that car in the way. Let me see. I'm going to meet with the boys real quick. Nah, I'll set up, babe. You're good right now. Let me see your watch, God damn, come here. Woo, what bitch ain't tall, that bitch ain't boy, what bitch ain't boy, shit. Oh, come here, come here. You tough, tough. Yeah, damn. Birthday, girl. You got your shoes, wait, what? Yeah. Hey, birthday girl. Hey, birthday girl. Hey, you ready to have some fun? You wanna go see Flash? All right, I'm gonna make sure y'all have fun. They wanna do They're gonna have the time of their life. <laughs> and then we come back, we're gonna put, look, we come back, we're gonna put it together, okay? I promise y'all, make sure we put it together for you. She gonna like that. Put it in her. Man, come on. Heavy. You know what we're going to go through it for that bit together. You know? <laughs> hey, he said, you know what it is? He said, have it. <laughs> uh, all right, so y'all, these kids, about to have the time of their life today. You're going to take them out. See. Baby, I got to turn your lights off. Motherfucking light bill. <laughs> they said, motherfucking light bill. Had to turn hey, that's country as hell, boy. Hey, you think I'm going to need anything else? I'm trying to make sure I don't need anything else. Hold on, let me, let me think. Let me think. All right, boom, my wallet keys. I got my books. I'm gonna go read while Bay Dry. I made Bay Dry, huh? Coco Bun. Y'all see, she looked to leave lights on around here, right? Be pissing me off because the eye light bill is $1,300. That's how I like bill. My light bill is somebody rent. That's crazy. Huh. Hey, Tim, 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 come on now. Turn these motherfuckers off. But how, though? Y'all gotta be leaving lights on, like every single light, refrigerator door open, everything to get that to get up that high. That's crazy. Or or it just must take a lot of energy to uh to for the lights to be on in that type of house. My they probably got a million different lights. You know how us we got one room light, one living room light, one kitchen light. <laughs> it's one for everything, bro. Right? It's one. Look, you see, that's one little light. They probably got a like million of things all through the house. So that's probably why. But that's crazy. $1,000. Shit. I got it. I got it. Hey, she's still shit. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Look, that's too much. That's that too many right there already. No. <laughs> she like, she's so adorable. Hold oh, no. on. Okay, that was all. Okay, I'm outside with the boys, all right? The key. Let, let me know. Come on that side, though. Shannon, give me your feet. Give me your feet, girl. Hold on. What, what happened? Yeah, come on. Come on, 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 come on.
Nah, that, if that's if you he's standing there the way it seems like he's standing there, you you for so paying something, bro. Yeah, you you paying something, especially if again Corey might have you know smut on his name, smut on his image, no dirt on his on his image, whatever. But I think for the most part, for the most part, out of a hundred percent, he's probably like a a seven like a sixty percent good man. So, so yeah, them bills paid. And it be thirteen hundred dollars. Thirteen hundred. You gonna walk around here and leave every light on? Come on. That's rent, literally. That's rent, literally. Hell to the mall. Turn them lights off, bruh. Hey, socks. You gotta give me your opinion. Have you seen Channing Tennant that go with um the bracelet? Yeah. You had that damn necklace. I know I wore it while I was in church. Okay, so check uh you know what I'm gonna check one. Alright, we're gonna end right there. I got other videos too. Make sure I like and subscribe.